Hey, this is Pastor Dave, and this is your Monday Mojo coming to you from the MLK Center just off of Illinois and 38th Street here in Indianapolis on this Martin Luther King Jr. Observance Day. So yesterday, I, I, I forget what media source it was, I think it was Twitter, where I saw someone say, tomorrow on Martin Luther King Jr. Observance Day, please don't post any of his quotes if you haven't spoken the names of several of the persons who've been victims of injustice. Just don't post any of his quotes if you're not willing to do that. And, and I get what the person was saying. Live with some integrity is what he was saying, I think. And you know, it, social media is a strange amalgam of all kinds of things. You get brilliant intellect and you get some verbal diarrhea is the best way to put it. And you get emotions that have no meaning to them and you get accusations and you get anger and you get all kinds of things on social media. So you get what you, you get what you, you know, sign up for, I guess. We were watching an episode of Law and Order last week and, and the person who was on trial had shot and killed a gossip columnist saying that he had ruined his life and uh, Jack was prosecuting says it's interesting you say that he's ruined your life and he was a high profile person in the community he said so you say media is bad and yet here are two instances where you use the media for your own good for your own company and so you know not really living with integrity I guess that's the point here you know the, the thing about Martin Luther King Jr. is that he believed something and he lived it. I guess that, that is the definition of integrity. When what you say you believe becomes the way you behave. When your values match up with what you're actually doing. And so on this Martin Luther King Jr. Day, it's worth remembering that this was a gentleman who lived that way. And I suppose we ought to do the same. We ought to decide what is it that we truly value and then let that drive how we live. We ought to decide what it is that we say we believe and then look at our behaviors to see if they match up. And if they don't, it's more likely that our behaviors are revealing what we believe. And at that point, we might want to say, you know what? I need to make an adjustment. Anyway, Martin Luther King Jr. showed us that it takes integrity and it takes hard work to live out what you believe. So on this day where we remember his life and what he lived out for us, I think we ought to do the same thing with our own. Anyway, that's your Monday Mojo here in Indianapolis.